So, hey guys, we're back and we're back with Ala Mobile. Path to Glory series. Last time we won in Monaco, actually, consecutive win. We won in Spain, then we won in Monaco. Now our eyes are into Canada. We go to the qualifying as we became a strong force in the racing series. Now we are a very strong driver, it feels like, and also our team has improved a lot. And so we can absolutely push more. We are looking very, very positive, and I can, I can absolutely see the improvement that our team has made, and also us as a whole. We actually, you know, developed a lot, and I feel very comfortable in this car right now. And here we go. We are finishing our qualifying. Let's see where we finish. Mate, how you do it? You are on pole position again, man. You are on pole position again. <laughs> Yes, guys! Congrats, guys! Congrats! Yes! Yes! Woohoo! Three in a row! Seems good, very good! Guys, we cannot believe actually we managed to get yet another pole, three poles in a row. That is like that is like like the thing which you can't even imagine in your dreams. A Williams getting consecutive poles in modern F1 from a rookie driver. Is that is that like Wow, like that is like unbelievably developing thing that it's like our car and we as a whole like bonding very nicely. So we are very here we go. We are loaded into the grid and let's see what we can do starting from the pole position. We have the Ferrari of Carlos Sainz just in second to you know maybe hoping to do something on us because but we are very strong and we do not it's not like Williams and Williams are slow it's like Williams are also fast with Anki and let's go let's see what we do here we go here we go Fallas are going to on here we go starting from the pole position lights out and away we go green Canada and right away the Ferrari takes the lead and we lost the P1 for the pole position but can we do it to the inside no we cannot do it to the inside but the Red Bulls are coming both the Red Bulls are behind me and we cannot lose it we have to maintain it we already lost one position but we cannot afford to lose anymore but the Ferrari seems a bit quick on the start there and right away taking away the lead from me but that doesn't mean that I will give up I will try my best the Ferrari locks up a little bit you can see some smokes coming from the tire he just locks up a little bit but we still could not overtake the Ferrari Ferrari is still there leading we are in P2 Here we go guys, we are about to start our lap number 2, we are still very close to the Ferrari, we are maintaining a gap, not losing much time behind, but still could not able to make any overtake move, but can we do it to the first corner, no, just too far there, uh, but that doesn't mean I am not trying, I am just trying my best to see whatever I can do to get the move done on the Ferrari because I don't want to lose well we also have a bit of a low ERS too we have to harvest more there man did you see that he just was too slow there dangerously too slow there on the exit what's wrong with the Ferrari man we saw that we saw that man we saw that so you've seen the Ferrari was a bit slow there on the exit that I have to slam hard on my brakes to prevent hitting the Ferrari on the rear end. I mean, I don't know what, maybe probably just missed a shift and just was slow there on the exit because of the miss of the gear shifts. But we are still very close to the gearbox of the Ferrari and we are still trying our best to get the move done on the Ferrari to get back the lead. Can we do it this time? No. Far away, far away. You know the Ferrari seems quicker as we are unable to still do the move on Ferrari for the lead but can we do it right now to the corner here we go down to the inside but I uh, couldn't do it again I mean the Ferrari is pretty much there now we are on the straight now the Red Bull is gaining on us you can see now we have been attacked but we're thinking to made box now box confirm box confirm yeah confirm confirm so you have heard that our team has called us for the stop uh, we will switch to the medium tire you can see the ferrari also boxing with us now you can see Carlos signs is there there we go Carlos are getting in his box now our box is you know further there 
so we are still moving on the pit lane let's see what happens with our pit stop here we go changing the tires to the medium tires and it seems to be a pretty okay okay pit stop but the ferrari is still there up ahead and here we go exiting from the pit lane mate watch out watch out there's alvin spinning in the pit exit watch out for that so here we go we are fresh with our medium tires but with our cold so not getting the grip and going wide very close to hitting the alpine but we the red will just got us there i mean cold medium tire couldn't get the turning grip which was there still getting a lot of understeer and oh, gone off again this is not going good we are losing time the tires are not getting the temperature and the grip and i just did two sort of a not good thing happened there i gone wide there not getting the grip which i expected now more cars pitting gonna be careful to the pit exit there because cars are coming there we go there's the mercedes there and the mercedes joins the track and we are in p13 right now but uh, yeah it was not very good timing i i can pretty much say because i was left in the traffic you know with the other cars who haven't boxed yet and also cold tires there and couldn't get the grip up i think it was a bit of a wrong timing to call me little bit i can i can i feel like that but now we are very close to the mercedes sparks are coming on to my face but the mercedes is fighting with the alpine so i have to be careful to get something of a thing to get the overtake done on the mercedes we are fighting for the track position with the mercedes there and uh, that is russell up ahead the mercedes of george russell uh, but the alpine haven't boxed yet so he will box our actual fight is with the mercedes but uh, just just unable to find anything right now but that doesn't mean i'm not going to try we are still in p13 more car boxes so we will uh, progress can we dive to the inside no who couldn't do it couldn't do it okay you can see the alpine already boxed there so we are now head to head with the mercedes for the upcoming position of george russell let's see what can we do can we find anything we are gaining can we dive to the inside is it the possible move now george russell gets it back that was crazy we almost done the move but george russell gets it back now we have a hus behind us who just pitted with the fresh new soft tires but we are running out of laps can we do the move now no still couldn't do it we're lap 9 out of 10 so not much lap i still remaining i mean not much of a lap remaining i don't know what i'm saying but i need to do the move on just russell because mercedes guys and the mercedes also be like no 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 junior team i won't let you go and i'm be like senior team i will attack you no matter what the but has is actually uh, coming in so i have to go a little bit defensive right there but we still couldn't do it we are on the last lap and you can see still chasing george russell for the position that is p5 right now after everyone boxed guys we are really running out of laps and whatever is remaining i have to do it we are still very close to the mercedes attempting to do a move can we drop to the inside this time can we do stick the move but we gone wide the mercedes just a little bit toss to the wheel and i'm just going on but uh, we couldn't get a position again i tried my best this time but i little bit ran wide the mercedes cut across and little bit contact on the front uh, left and i just need to be tried but it's still fighting hard it's just hard fighting just hard fighting for the position can we dive to the inside of the hairpin can we do it this time you can see the understeer strikes in because we let wake but the mercedes still maintains it from the outside this is insanely crazy this is whatever i can do i'm just trying we are not left to any years we only have there is can we do it to the last corner we are getting will be the latest breaking late breaking can we do it but cut the chance at the car because of the hard breaking but no way no way we still couldn't get the position we try our best ah p6 guys that was insanely fighting i just tried everything to the last corner ah uh, mate i tried my best mate i tried my best just uh, ah
Mate, you did your best. You did your best. That was pretty impressive fight there. You finished P6. It was pretty, pretty impressive there where you are fighting there, mate. You mate. It's okay. It's okay. Completely okay. We'll be fighting for the win next time. But don't be like, don't be sad. We are pretty happy with that. The way, way you fought and got back up to the positions. Yeah, the pit stop timing. I guess it was. Um, okay fine mate but uh, next time we'll surely you did your best this time mate you did your, we are very happy with that and don't be sad you drove like a champ mate you drove like a champ and yeah mate next time we'll be hoping the best okay mate don't be sad mate don't be sad it's completely okay it's completely okay it's pretty solid position yeah mate next time eyes on to the next time yeah mate yeah mate thank you martin thank you martin so yeah guys we finished p6 uh the race result we fought hard with the mercedes to get the position but we couldn't manage to do it i guess it went little bit wrong after the pit stop because i was left in the traffic and also the cold tire just went messy you can say i mean we'll be rectifying our mistakes next time as a whole team uh, it's still a pretty solid position to be in you can see albon is in p uh, p13 right yeah p13 so not scoring point we are scoring a point this time for the team but yeah guys we will be hoping the best next time out yeah it just went a little bit messy this time out but we don't lose hope we don't lose hope we think positive and of course next time we'll be doing this thank you to everyone there in the team martin and all the race engineers all the mechanics everyone down there in the factory thank you for everyone for giving me this opportunity we'll be doing best next time and hoping the best you know positive positive okay